welcome back to my channel um my name is crystal also known as good girl gone fashion i um am doing this video today um about why i'm selling my chanel bag so i thought this would be kind of interesting but yes um if you like the video give it a thumbs up um subscribe to my channel um because i am getting more consistent and also follow me on Instagram at Good Girl Gone Fashion, just how it sounds. So stick around. All right. So um, for those of you who are gonna ask, um, my sweatshirt is by Stilettos and Standards. Um, I will link them below in the um, description box, um, and it just says Black Women Deserve Luxury on it, which we do. And this is not an unboxing or anything. I've had this um, Chanel bag for a long time. Well, not a long time, a couple of years. And um, the bag that I have, here's the dust bag that came with it. And I have um, the Chanel boy bag. God, it's gorgeous. So the reason more so why I would like to sell this bag is because I honestly don't think I'm getting my cost per wear and I'm trying to be more, what's the word that I wanna say? I wanna be able to wear my pieces and I don't feel like I wear this enough and for the amount of money that I pay for it, it, it should be worn. Like I should be getting my cost per wear. So I only feel like I wear this bag if like I'm going to a wedding, if I'm going out uh, with LA or um, Maybe like a very special occasion, maybe even a birthday, but even on my birthday, I don't feel like I reach um, for this bag enough. So um, this is the medium size. It also comes in a smaller size and a jumbo. But um, this size honestly made more sense to me. And when I originally purchased this bag, I kind of went back and forth between the jumbo well not the jumbo sorry the classic flap in the boy bag and i just chose um the boy bag because i felt like it would be a little bit more edgier and go with more of my looks which it did um but i just didn't reach for it as much and it's pretty spacious in the inside Sorry, I try to keep it stuffed. Um, it is pretty um, scratched up, but the company that I'm selling it to, which is Fashion File, um, I sent them very good pictures. So they're aware of how this bag is gonna come to them. So this is the inside of the bag. And yeah, it has just the one pocket here in the inside. And as much as I love it, I love that the hardware is matte. I'm kind of, I, I do want another Chanel, but I want something more. So not that I can wear every day, but something that I can definitely just kind of grab and and go and not have to worry about like babying it so much. I'm mean, even though this is black, like I'm still very like cautious when I wear it. Like I always want it close to me. I don't want to sit it down on anything. And I feel like I can always um, find another one of these or um, the classic Chanel flap. So that's why it's not gonna hurt me to let it go. So, and also um, with this bag, I, 
I can only wear it um, like this on my shoulder. I could wear it cross body or I could wear it like this. Like I wanna be able to uh, maybe have something. Um, recently I've been into top handles and um, with the Chanel 19 um, that has a top handle. I think the Chanel um, Coco that has a top handle and then I am the one I'm looking at, um, which I will do a video on if I get that bag, um, that has a top handle as well. And it's it's more so of a fun bag. And that's kind of like what I'm into right now. Fun accessories that make the outfit just stand up or take the outfit up a notch. And I feel like this definitely does that, but um, I just don't reach for it as much. So um, like I said, earlier I'm gonna sell this um, to Fashion File and they already gave me a quote and everything on it so I don't think I think if I waited even longer I don't think I would get what they're offering me so I'm gonna go ahead and sell it and I've sold to Fashion File before um, a couple of my handbags and I haven't had any issues I've heard horror stories but, um, yeah, so, yeah, so I do, um, want to replace it with another Chanel, but not something as massive as the boy bag. But again, um, this is the bag. It's a, it's a beautiful bag. I'm, I'm really going to miss it. She has a name and everything. But um, it's just time to let her go. You know, I don't wear it. And I just, you know, kind of want something else, which I don't mind doing, um, like switching out different um, bags in my collection. Like some bags I will grab all day, every day. And then some bags I don't want to, not necessarily don't want to touch, but some bags I don't reach for or I don't grab. So I know I'm not getting my cost per wear or exactly what um, I pay for the bag. Like I'm not getting good use of the bag. So um, let me know, like in the comments, let me know if you think that I'm making a terrible decision or let me know if you understand. Um, I also don't mind like switching it up here and there as well. And that's kind of what I want to do right now. So, um, that's just a brief reason as to why I'm selling my Chanel bag. And again, um, my name is Crystal. I'm kind of new to YouTube. So definitely subscribe. Um, give me a thumbs up if you like this video and follow me on Instagram at good girl gone fashion. And I will see you in my next video. <laughs> Toodles. <laughs>